I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Tigers. I'm Devin. And I'm Casey, and today is Friday, January 31st. Happy birthday to, drumroll please, <laughs> Joey Barnett. And congratulations to the winner of the Trivia Thursday, Tori Benz. You can pick up your t-shirt in the Mac Lab, Room 101. I'm working on my vocabulary for the ACT. Bet you can't use this one, scrutinize. I've got that. It means look at something carefully. Yeah, like while you're watching this next video, scrutinize Junior's very interesting diagram. Ooh. Useful study tips for the average teenager. Rule number one, study in the right place. The world is full of noises, so finding a quiet place to study with minimal distractions is very important. Your school's library is a good place to start. Rule number two, bring what you need and nothing you don't. Once you find a nice place without distractions, you don't want to bring your own. Leave things that may help you lose your concentration in your locker. What you do need are the basics. Computer, textbooks, pencil, paper, and any special tool for what you're studying, like a calculator. Rule number three, plan out ahead of time. Come prepared with a list of what you need to study. Make a checklist and complete it in order, but allow yourself to take short breaks in between. Most of us use studying as a chore, so a break is a nice incentive. Rule number four. Use a few different methods to study. Nobody likes to study notes after notes after notes after notes. Isn't that right, Junior? Instead, try something different like making a flowchart. Flashcards or even just highlighting key concepts and reading over them again. Rule number five, don't freak out. Just take a deep breath and get to work. Remind yourself that if you follow these rules, I will pass no problem, daddy. Granddaddy, Stepdaddy, Daddy, uh, what was he studying? I don't know, but he must have gotten an A. Speaking of another word that starts with A, awesomeness, we have a cut in the act. On January 18th, Dalton Shaw and Aaron Rue were caught helping a community member out of a snowbank. They had shovels in hand and helped push the vehicle to freedom. Nice job, Dalton and Aaron. With all these snow days, we've got a lot of rescheduled events going on. Good luck to the wrestlers and girls hockey team at home tonight. And to the girls basketball team at Loyal. And to the boys basketball team at GET. And don't forget, the boys hockey team. Tomorrow night, they take on Sparta at home. Dun dun dun. Oh no, I almost forgot. What? To order my yearbook. Oh my gosh. You have to order it now. The deadline is today. Did you know that we ran out last year? The only way to guarantee a book is if you order today. I know. And you know, they can't just print another one for you. I know. And you can order online now at jostinyearbooks.com. I know. Or you could call 1-866-282-1517. I know. Or you could mail a check or a money order with the order form you got in the mail. Yep, I know. Well, get going then. I know! You're welcome. 